Welcome back to Ryan Fork. And today we're doing an, a review of the new Cheeky Face album, It's Sorted. So yeah, I know I'm kind of late to the party, but then I just kind of learned about Cheek Face recently. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry for this reason. So it's kind of my introduction to the band. I'm glad to say that I'm like not disappointed. I think this album is very interesting. I think it's very captivating in some ways, and I just want to talk about it which combines like these elements of pop rap and rock and i think they just do it so well well enough for me to like actually like get wind of this album and try to check it out and see what all the hype was about top i want to say like i appreciate like the performance of the lead singer i think he just does an amazing performance throughout this album he's kind of like little dicky minus the gross self deprecation and actually like good on the pen like these flows are great his bars are great his singing is great he's so comfortable on the mic which is praiseworthy if anything and i think this album is mostly lyrically based because the production is like smooth it's like well produced it's clean but then it's not like show stopping it's not like taking the stage or something but then it's more like to give more focus on the lyrics and how like wacky and insane and amazing they are so let's get into the favorite tracks, let's not waste any time. One of my favorite tracks was Life in a Bag, which I thought was funny and cute and had like some solid production. And my best track on this album, of course, it has to be Plastic. I think I love the stream of consciousness overflowing delivery that we got going on here. I love the great hook, it's so addictive. It's, I love the back and forth at the end when it's, it's like, oh, it's recyclable. It's sorted. And it's recyclable. It's sorted. And it's just kind of like go back and forth on that. I think it's very heady. I think it's very like, it's, it's very trippy. It's very trippy and I love that in a song. Then we have Grade School, which has like these nicely arranged guitars. It has this skittering guitar plugs and like very introspective lyrics. I really love this song and I really enjoyed listening to it. And then we have The Fringe, which has been stuck in my head since I started listening to it. Like I just found myself like just walking up and down just hearing The Fringe, the fringe blah, 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 in my ear. And like, this, it's amazing. It's a great track. It's funny. I love how comfortable he is on this track. I love how it is baggy he is. And then we have, I am continuing my thing, which I, I love the little repetitive chirps that are like sung throughout the song. I love, I love like how, I love how talking head-esque it kind of is. is. If like maybe David was more monotone, I think this is what you would like probably write and make. Because it kind of like has the production side in the bag. And then the last of my favorite tracks is Trophy Hunting at the Zoo, which I thought was an interesting song. I thought it was fun. I thought it was a little cool, like, interlude in the album. And then uh, tracks that I'm iffy about. Not a, not a lot. I, I really did love a lot on this album. And the tracks that I kind of iffy about were the tracks where he kind of, like, gets too campy, too niche, gets too into that, like, type of bag for me to, like, really, like, truly appreciate and those songs would be like Large Muscle and Popular too. But other than that, I loved everything on this album. I think this album is amazing. I think it shows a very unorthodox band like at, at their best, at their peak career and creative wise. So let me just plug it in. I'll rate this album an 8 out of 10. I thought this album was very enjoyable. I thought it was very... A very interesting type of like experience, which I I didn't really have high hopes for this album, but then kind of like just drew me back in and how interesting it is. So yeah, please check out Cheeky Face. It's sorted. It's out now. And press that like, press that subscribe, and I'll see you on the next video. Peace.